So I found this Twitter thread where <laughs> somebody started to compile all of the awful things that people have been doing to Koroks in Tears of the Kingdom. The first one is one of many that I've seen like this since. Uh, just a, a casual Korok crucifixion. <laughs> somebody made a Korok rotisserie machine. The amount of effort required to do that, because they would have to make the rotisserie machine, which I guess is, oh, that's a really small plank of wood with just two sticks. But they had to bring all the Koroks all to this one place. <laughs> Look at how they're all like sweating. Oh man. This one is uh, a Korok being used as like the front of a ship type vibe. This is like the first one that you find as well. Do you think Nintendo expected this to happen? Do you think they knew mankind would do this? Surely they did. This one from the Reddit, Korok Space Program. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, oh buddy. Oh. This is just like a more elaborate version of the same thing. Giant leaf for tree gate. Korok space program day two. After adopting a more typical rocket shaped structure, I had high hopes for this brave Korok. However, the extra weight had some unexpected effects of today's launch. Yeah. Oh, wow. Wow. I wonder if... If they can go that high. They're probably pretty weighty. Well... Did it tip? <laughs> and of course it's just falling to the ground. Did it tip because the Korok added the weight to the e Yeah, it did. You have to put it right in the middle. Physics, man. Well, this one's probably having a good time at least. That seems like it's fine for him. He's just on a little joyride. It's not that crucifixion-y because it's, it's not a proper cross. He's just... <laughs> oh! <laughs> this one's a snowmobile? Oh, it's a rocket on the snow. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> and also the first tweet is, hey, Violate Geneva, does this count? Which I guess is a Twitter account. A catalog of violatable and non-violatable G Geneva conventions in video games. So this is basically any time that you can violate the Geneva convention in a video game. That's amazing. Link's carnival rides now open for business, great. Oh, what's gonna happen though? He's just gonna go really fast? Right? <laughs> oh my god, that's the worst one. And that's also a friend of mine, Brendan. I worked with him at IGN. That's rough. But then we have people who moved on to the sign guy who says, don't let the sign touch the ground. Um, Koroks weren't good enough. People had to torture him too. <laughs> Amazon delivery of Korok. <laughs> That's really cute. <laughs> I'm not even mad about that one. I don't think the AI was ready for this taxi. That's really smart. You can make them hit themselves. Oh my god. I guess, especially because your abilities are unlimited, you just bully them. This one's a Korok cannon? Oh. Where did he even 
god. The paddle boat design, practical side, is it a lot less... Wheels take a lot less battery fans. I mean, that looks ridiculous. But it actually kind of works. Oh my god. That is incredible. Dude. This game is so technically impressive. Wild. That's so, so, so cool. Look at death cage. What? Well, what is it? Because he's trying to, gonna try and break out? The cage is gonna break in on him? I didn't even notice the flamethrowers. Oh my god. How many of them are there? Three? This one's so rough I have to watch it again. Oh my god. What is wrong with the internet? I never would have thought you'd be doing this stuff in a Zelda game in my life, dude. Wild. Since his mistakes were made, okay. They've tried to build just a really tall sort of Oh, it went too fast and the flame caught on it. It caught up to like its own it's the the <laughs> fuck off. <up. laughs> no way. It went too fast, and so the flame has a trail behind. Dude. Where does it happen? Oh, uh, you kind of can't see. That's so funny. Roasting the marshmallows? I'm just gonna light the whole thing on fire? Oh my god. Oh, so unnecessary. This one, I love. I think this is my favorite creation that I've seen yet. Literally a Trojan horse. What does it have in it? Oh, it's got a link in it. That tracks, yeah, that's pretty scary. It's so cool. Uh, okay, I wanted to just have fun watching some of these, but I don't want to actually look any further because there was one thing that I saw on here that I was like, oh, I wish I hadn't seen that. Um, just said like an open world thing that I was like, oh, I'm getting in some spoiler territory. Happy to see what weird inventions people have made. If you guys enjoy this video, want me to make another one, let me know. Um, Cause it's obviously very fun for me to sit here and <laughs> look at some of this stuff. I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. I've never made a video like this before. It just seemed fun. <laughs> I wanna, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.